Don't ask me why, but I have not been paying any attention to the update log, but there is an update. Purchase consumable crates in the inventory, 300 for low grade, 750 for mid, and 50 Robux for high. Barricades, blizzard bombs, cooldown flags, damage flags, range flags, flashbangs. There's a lot. You can read through them if you want. Uh, stop any from passing through with the brigade. Freeze them with the blizzard bombs. Let's see. VIP plus is 50% XP increase. Uh, your in-game friends get a 10% boost. 100% uh, uh, crate luck increase. Just, just double crate luck. Uh, equip towers appear as pets. I personally hate this so far. A subscription? Really, TDS? Speedier game. That, I feel like, would be could be very good. Little did I know, it's Robux only. Random stuff, game performance, and new tower, maybe a rework too. Ooh. So the TDS Discord did give us this, which tells us the next rework will be the commander. They also said that the next tower will be called the brawler, which is pretty cool. It looks here to me that the commander is going to summon stuff. I think that's pretty cool. There's a lot, so... I think the flags are going to be some of the best. Just the buffs are great. And they're each for one minute. Okay. Here are the crates. So it looks to me like the high grade one has everything above rare. The mid grade one has just higher chance, but you can get everything. And it's the same with the low, but higher chance of the war stuff. I still don't like these. I bought three of each. Let's see what I get. So low grade, barricade. Eh, that's not great. Oh, you get multiple. Okay, okay, that's that's not as bad. Second one, here we go. Flashbang, grenade, UAV, damage flag. Okay. Okay, last one. Grenade, airstrike, UAV, flashbang, and that's it. Okay. Throw it once. Darn, nothing good. Let's move on to the better, I don't know what they're called, the better ones. Just want the blizzard thing. Damage flag. Blizzard bomb, we got it! No nuke, but the nuke is just the chance on it's stupid. I won't go over all of them today, I'll just go over a few. If you want the whole one, check out Corso's video. Hopping in, there's already a new UI. I don't necessarily like it, but I'm sure we'll get used to it. So we hit T and it switches us from one to the other. Okay, that's not too bad. Although it feels so small. The Molotov has a tiny range, I'm gonna say this is not worth it, but you do hold it in your hand, which is kind of nice. Whoa, for the barricade, this sounds loud, but you throw up a, uh, a hammer and then you, I'm sure you just place that somewhere. And the air, the airstrike has a bit more range. The radar is kind of nice. The flags wobbles are so fun. What this flag does is it continuously buffs everything in its range for a minute with 40% damage buff, which is actually really good. If you replace something, it'll still have the buff. It's also looking like you can only use a set amount per game. Like we had seven flags, but we can only use three, only five Molotovs, four uh, of those, and one of those. So the Cowboys can hit until, we'll say like, here about. So if we do that, me uses barricade. Okay. And then it's just 150 health barricade there. Ooh, I'm stupid. Uh, if only we had the other thing. Okay, so that barricade's gonna keep us alive, but it's not gonna save us. Got it. Uh, let's go and just get an excel to hold us off and for any backups. TDS can be very uneventful, so let's just zoom through this. Zoom, 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 in, out, out, in, zoom, zoom. It's like a movie made by Michael Bay. Lots of angles, close angles, far angles, inside angles, out angles, in angles, upside down, inside out. Oh my god, it's so three hours later. Oh, I forgot to use the other stuff. Let's see, the Molotov, small range, I'm... Okay, can it kill the giant bosses? I have no idea. Let's see. Yeah, that did nothing. So, the Molotov is definitely an early game thing. Look at the wiggle on that flag, I love it. We'll use the flag on the boss. We already saw a barricade, but I'll drop it back here, because 150 health will save us. Ooh, the airstrike has more range. What will it do? Okay, I like that. It reminds me a lot of what the military base has. Okay, it's here. So, now... Actually, I'll, I'll wait till they're on the stun. Alright, so I use it. Yeah, now they all have a 40% is really good, but they all have 40% damage.
damage about. It's really loud, so editing lol is taking over. This lasts for a minute, everything in the area continuously gets it. So you sell something, put it back, it'll still have it. It's very, very good. And 40% is higher than you can get, other than with the flag. This makes it so if you're chaining properly, the Fallen King is not going to be a problem. You're fine. Zoom, 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 in, out, out. Come on, barricade! You can take him out. Barricade, maybe barricade is some form of poison, definitely poison, and it's not the excels and the it's going down because of the barricade, all because of the barricade, and, 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 and it is about to go down. There, I did it. All because of the barricade. Don't doubt it, it's just a barricade. So, I don't like this update at all. The new UI, it's gonna take getting used to. It's just overall, I'm not a big fan of this update. I'm sure this is, this is a big one either way. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Also, in the comments, if you made it here, tell me what your favorite tower is. Also, Barricade, Undisputed S-Tier.